Mezaina. <laughs> uh, is my daughter there? Is she, where is she? Look, uh, listen, I, 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 I was coming to the school to pick her up and then my car broke down. So I had to uh, leave the car with the mechanic. Yes, but where, where is she? Sumi, right? Oh, thank God. Thank God. <laughs> you don't know how relieved I am. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's okay. It's fine. Yeah. Thank you. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. Thank you. back yet yeah but don't worry okay you'll be back soon all right um you can just sit down here or there and here anyway you'll be back soon okay Baby, you're not easy. Hey, darling. How are you? I'm fine. Hi. Daddy, welcome. Thank you. You were nowhere to be found. After school dismissed. I'm sorry, darling. I wasn't able to come and pick you as expected. But, uh, um. Daddy, Auntie Sumi has been taking care of me. Really? Yes. Okay. Thank you, Auntie Sumi. <laughs> you're welcome, sir. I should be on my way now. Okay, I uh, will. I'll be in touch. Okay. Okay. Honey, baby, bye bye. Bye, Auntie. <laughs> bye. Come on, let's go. Okay. So, um, okay. what happened? How did she take care of her? Disability. Physical disability differ in types and types of physical disabilities. Types of physical disabilities. Types of um, physical di disability. Differ. Physical disabilities. So types of physical disabilities. Types of physical disabilities. Physical Physical disabilities differ in types and in severity. Uh, the either case is always a link to the victim's normal process and purpose of life. Then we have one. Do you pronounce that? Cerebral palsy. Can you pronounce that? Cerebral. 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 Palsy. Palsy. Cerebral palsy. What does it mean? But you have to plan for the best days. Oh, no, 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 no. I need the car fixed today. Get it fixed. And then you bring it to me. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Just get it fixed and bring it to me. Do your job and I'll take care of that. All right? Okay, good. Good. Bye. Hey, darling. Daddy. Mm. I don't like this channel. I want yeah. to watch cartoon. The remote is right next to you. Change it if you want. Besides, um, what would you like to eat so I can fix you something to eat? I would like to eat potato chips and sauce. Oh? You know there is no potato in this house. 
Second option. Potato chips and sauce. Hey, you're being evil. No potatoes in this house and you keep calling potato chips and sauce. <laughs> you almost get it for. Oh? Well, I just I want to eat potato chips and sauce. Okay. I'll go out and get some potatoes, okay? I'll be right back, okay? Daddy, mm -hmm. you know I can't stay alone. No, I won't be long. I'll be right back, okay? Mm -hmm. Just uh, watch the house for me. I'll be right back. What? I can't stay alone. Okay, come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. TV off. Let's go. No need to struggle It takes only a genius to solve this puzzle There are little things that matters Little things that make big difference But we choose to look it over how long will it take for you to understand that every action counts? So pay attention to the details. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Good evening. How are you? Fine, fine. All right. Enjoy your evening. Thank you, too, sir. Okay. Oh, okay. What's the question? Alexa, what is it now? What is it? Why are you looking at someone's husband in, in, in that manner? What do you mean by that? He was someone's husband, not any longer. He's a single dad. Oh. Like, hey, we do our what? I don't understand. Let's go, please. <laughs> you leave me alone now. It takes only a genius to solve this. Also, there are little things that matters, little things that makes big difference, but we choose to look it over. How long will it take for you to understand that every action counts? So Pay attention to details, don't act out of your feelings, get your facts before the action. Pay attention to details, don't act out of your feelings, get your facts before the action. Oh no 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 no. The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Oh, no, 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 no. The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Nobody is entitled to the bright side of life. If you spark the fire, then it will burn for you Nobody is entitled to the best things of life Life runs in circles when it's on its table Whatever you've tendered is what you pick at the table Life runs in circles Oh, hey, sweetie. <laughs> oh, welcome. How are you, darling? I'm good. And you? I'm okay. I'm doing good. <laughs> um, welcome. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. And you have that. Don't worry. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> oh, good. Sorry about that.
Maybe girl, there is something you're not telling me. <laughs> What's so attractive about this man? Ah. Uh, Mr. Richard is a very nice man. He's so calm, gentle. You need to see him on different occasion with his little girl. You need to have a sight on how he loves and care for that girl, despite the hard time he's going through. You seem to know a lot about him. <laughs> Where did you gather your information or did you have a chat with him? No. Certainly it's not easy taking care of the little girl and still be going to work. He needs a woman in his life. And I wish I'm that woman. I wish to wake up one morning and find myself in his arm. <laughs> uh -uh. <laughs> oh my god. What's funny? Why are you laughing? Babe, imagination won't finish you. My sister, imagination won't finish me. I swear to die. Ah. You know what? I just I just believe that this thing will happen one day. Just, I just have this little faith oh, that one day I'm going to be with him. Just that he doesn't seem interested in having anything to do with a woman. Uh -huh. I don't know how to approach him and tell him how I feel about him. Be dreaming. You, this girl, not even helping matter. What, what, kind of, what kind of a friend are you? You find this at this moment you're talking about him. I don't even notice. I bet you yet. Go, go, go. go away. Come on, be going. I bet go and bring that pasta you cooked. <laughs> Hayley. Yes, sir. Come here. Come and eat. The potato chips and egg sauce. It's ready. Daddy. What? I don't like those potato chips and egg sauce. What? What did you say? Don't even try it. You insisted you wanted to eat potato chips and egg sauce. I don't have any other thing for you to eat. So you will eat it. Ha. No, Daddy. What is no? Snacks. What? You want snacks? You want snacks? You made me to wake up. I, I went to buy potatoes to make this for you. And you're telling me you don't want to eat it? You will eat it. I'm not making you any other thing. I don't have anything to make for you. I want snacks. Hey, just stop it. Stop it. Eat the food. I want snacks. <laughs> Ellie, what is it now? I want snacks. I want snacks. I want snacks. Eat the food. Uh -uh. I want snacks. I don't want to eat it. I want snacks. I want snacks. Mm, Daddy, I want snacks. Stop it. I want snacks. I just stop. <laughs> mm, I want snacks. I don't want to eat it. I want snacks. Oh, smell. Oh. Babe. Yes. Don't you think it's it's time we visited the hospital? Why would you want us to visit the hospital? Because of my inability to give birth, of course. Um, why are you sounding like this? Listen, darling, you only visit the hospital if you are unable to conceive. Sweetheart, you've conceived. It's just that we lost the baby to miscarriage. And you do not think there may be some medical solutions to avoid miscarriages? Sweetheart, one of the major causes of miscarriage is stress. Okay? I promise you, once you take in again, I will do all the chores in this house so that you don't stress yourself again. I promise.
if you say so. Yes, I said so. <sighs> Let me go and ease myself and join you. Okay. That will keep me waiting. All right. <laughs> <laughs> of course not. Of course not. <laughs> Okay. Come in. The door is open. Hey, you. Sam Tuchuku. Sam Tuchuku. Uh, yeah. Are you okay? Good. Are you fine? Yeah, yeah, yes. Did something bad happen? No, 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 sir. I'm, 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 I'm fine, sir. Okay, sit up. Oh, if you say so. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Um, are you sure you're okay? Yes, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm sure, sir. All right. Uh, look, um, Sami, I've, I've realized that um, you and Haley, you guys are very fond of each other. She likes you a whole lot, and she enjoys spending time with you. I also feel very comfortable whenever she's with you. I feel safe that um, you can take good care of her. So I want to make you an offer. An offer? Yes, an offer. I, I want you to be Haley's caregiver. Oh. Yeah, like uh, you, you take her to school, uh, you give her, her food to eat, you help her take her bath, uh, take care of her when I'm not around till I get back from work. Of course, I will put you on a very good salary. Um, okay, sir. I'm openly accepting the offer. But please, I do not want salary. I'm, I'm okay to do this. I, I really want to do it for you. I want to relieve um, the cutest dad's stress. I want to help you out. So it's fine. It's a yes without salary. Oh, you flatter me. <laughs> No, thank you, thank you. That's that's very kind of you. I am elated by your kind words. <laughs> thank you. Thank you too. Okay, so um, can I get a soft heart at least? Uh, that's okay. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. I really appreciate you. Okay. Thank you too. Yeah, oh, oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so, um, Me or whatever they call you, I want you to detail me on what is going on between you and Mr. Richard. Um, and who are you to make such demand? <laughs> I know you won't open up because you know what you are doing, but let me warn you quit whatever relationship you have with him because he belongs to me alone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you are the worst dreamer I've met in recent times. For your information, I won't let you any close, not even an inch close to Richard and I. Have a good day. Hey, God, this girl, this girl, this girl she's just so stubborn. What is this? I must have, I must have Richard. I must have him. Daddy, 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 wake up. Hey, what is it? What is it? My assignment. Oh, Dad. Okay, come on.
Come on, let me guide you through it. Come here. Thank you, Daddy. Anything for my baby girl? Okay, let me see. What chapter? Um, chapter six. Chapter six. Okay, let me see the note. Give me this one. Yes, I understand. Listen, mom. My wife was pregnant, yes. But she lost the baby. No, why are you sounding like this? She needs time to recover before we can make out again. That is not my business. Please. I don't want to have this conversation again. I don't want to. Wait. What's wrong? Who were you shouting on the phone with? My mom. <laughs> it was your mom you just spoke to in such manner? How could you? Babe, I told you that whatever mom says to you or does to you is because she just feels she's helping you out. No matter how disturbing whatever she's saying to you is, just reply her calmly. Come on. Give that woman a reason to be happy. She's your mother for goodness sake. Not when she's putting me through unnecessary pressure. I'm still telling her that my wife got pregnant and lost the pregnancy. She's still talking about grandchildren. Why is she so insensitive? I'm sorry, sweetheart. It's my fault. I don't know why God has decided to punish me this way. Sweetheart, it is not your fault. All right? I mean, you're not God that gives children. He knows what we are going through. And at the appointed time, he will give us our own child. You know, I don't like seeing you this way. is paining me. Daddy. Mm. My stomach is paining me. Daddy. What to say? What to say? My, my tummy is paining me. Why at this time of the night that I can't go out to buy you any medicine? Mm. Okay. Wait for me. Let me check for something for you. Daddy, I want to come with you. Morning, sir. Morning. Are um, you fine? Yes, I'm fine. I'm okay. so sorry I'm a little bit late. It's uh, okay. Can I join you in the kitchen? Uh, I'm almost done with the food. Oh, okay. Um, 
Is there anything I can help you with? Yes, sir. Uh, Haley, you can uh, help her take a shower and get dressed okay. as I dish the food. All right, sir. Is that okay? Yes, sir. All right, come with me. No need to struggle. It takes only a genius to solve this puzzle. There are little things that matters, little things that make me different. Sammy, Sammy. Please use the, the key behind the door. I have one in the car. Okay. I will use it. Oh, I don't want you guys coming here waiting here, you know, sitting in front of the door. Okay, sir, it's actually nice. Okay. Okay. All right, bye. Bye, Heli. Learn something new, okay? Bye bye. Uh, please be careful of the time, okay? I don't want her to be stranded at the school. Okay, sir. All, All right. right, I will. But you have to plan for the best days. Oh, no, 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 Hi, good morning. Person, good morning. How are you? Do I look fine to you? So me. Do you even wish me to be fine? <laughs> um, cousin, why won't you be fine? I wish my enemies will talk more of you, my best friend. Why won't I wish you to be okay? I don't understand. You call me your best friend. I, Cassin, your best friend. With this your attitude towards me. What attitude are you even talking about? So, me, let me ask you. Mm -hmm. What did you tell me on phone last night? Cousin, please. I made myself loud and clear to you last night. I am not interested in your advances. Please, I want to sound this as a note of warning. Stop pestering my life because that's what you're doing. And next time you see me on the road, do not stop me. Stop pestering me. I've made myself loud and clear. Just let me be. I'm not interested in you and I'll never be. Excuse me. Sorry, we used to be boyfriend and girlfriend though. Please stop Sorry, following me. Stop following me, Carson, please. Ah. Sorry. Sorry. Tommy, we used to be in love. Why are you? Are you oh, let me alone. Are you nuts? Tommy. You should be out Tommy, of your mind. Tommy. Where is the water? Oh, thank you, darling. You're welcome. <laughs> conversation. I mean, why are you disturbing yourself over a man that doesn't even know you're crushing on him? Okay, walk up to him and tell him you still don't have the courage. What do you want me to say? What do you want me to suggest? Walking up to him isn't the problem. Oh. What happened when I woke up to him is my fear. What if he rejects me? Oh my God, I will never forgive myself for opening up to him. What if he accepts me and then decides to break my heart afterwards? You know you can't trust me. My dear, <sighs> you will suffer migraine if you don't get this man off your head. You're no longer a child. Don't make a decision that you regret tomorrow, please. This man doesn't need a woman in his life. Don't you get it? He does. He does, Diana. And his daughter needs someone to play a motherly role in her life. Can't you see it? Can't you just get this picture? Can't you see what I'm going through? You don't. I repeat. Don't let your desperation ruin you. Because 
All I'm looking at right now is a desperate girl. Come on. I beg, I beg, we'll talk about another thing. You don't just get it. You don't. Can we change the subject? Better. I'm tired of you, Richard. Or you, he doesn't even know you. It's fine. Hey. So how was school today, Harley? It was fine. Really? Yes. Um, Harley, baby. Yes, auntie. You remember you promised to me. <laughs> yes, I promised to learn something new today. Wow. <laughs> I thought you must have forgotten. You're really brilliant. <laughs> auntie, I don't forget things so easily. Hmm. Um, should I recite what I learned today? Um, how about we do it this way? You're going to tell me what you were taught today. You tell me the subject and then the topic and I'll ask you questions based on the topic. How about it? Okay. All right. Um, what were you taught today? Um, I was taught fundamental human rights on civic education. Okay. So my number one question would be, what are the rights to freedom of speech? Hello, ma. Yeah, I'm fine. Um, I was calling to check on my daughter. Is she okay? Is she fine? Has she, has she been picked up? Oh yeah, fine, fine, fine. All right. Um, I was calling Sami. I wasn't getting her, so I was a bit worried. But uh, I'm glad. I'm glad she's fine. That's why I was calling. Her. Sorry to bother you. Enjoy the rest of your day, man. All right. Okay. Bye. I know I got the answers correctly, right? Hundred percent correctly. I am really impressed. I guess you must be the most brilliant in the class. I can't tell. According to my teacher, she says that we all are brilliant and she loves us. And none of us should feel that anyone is brilliant brilliant than other. Oh, oh, really? Yes. Wow, that must be really cool of her. She should be a nice teacher. Yeah. <laughs> um, please, excuse me, okay? So is it? Like, seriously? You blocked me. So, why won't I block you? You're pestering my life. I told you not to call me again. Cousin, how else do I have to tell you that I am not interested in dating you? I'm not interested. Oh, you've been dating me before now. Please, just let me be. Why are you doing this now? See, 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 see. Oh yeah, I'll save my number. I won't do anything. You block take me. your feelings somewhere else. Your feelings have for you is deep. Bro. Just take it to someone else. Uh, I'm serious. So me. Let me be. So me. I'm working. I'm telling you. Okay. Yes, my darling. I am fine. It's just some uh, So me. So me. So me. Oh yeah, come and add my number back. What if I want to call you? If I want to call you, Uncle. So me. Hey! Sammy! Hey! There are little things that matters. Little things that make me different. Don't mind me. I'm only taking precautionary measures to make sure there's no repeat of events. But, sweetheart, you know you really got me scared. Did you even feel dizzy before slumping? Honestly, I still can't explain everything that happened. Is it all good? Um, the doctor said you're pregnant, and you know what that means. Remember I said... I'm going to take up every single chores in this house to make sure you have enough rest, right? Mm -hmm. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. If that would help, I'd be so glad. Okay, which means that work starts now officially. So, what would you like to have for lunch, ma'am? 
Yes. What can I do for you, man? Choose to look it all. Okay. I came to assist you. At least helping you with the vegetables won't be stressful. Okay. So who said I need help? Listen. Just go back to the room. Lie down and sleep. But if you don't want to sleep, just go to the sitting room and watch the television. Babe, hello. Cooking is actually not stressful. It's it's so it's somehow relaxing and you know and how you do everything. I'm not complaining. I'm complaining. Listen, we have to be very careful this time around. Okay? Thank you. Come in. Mm. Can you? But you have to plan for the first time. Goodbye, man. Thank you. And it will burn for you. Nobody is in time to the best. Harry, you must be tired, right? Yes, Auntie. I need to rest. Hmm. Okay, how about I get you some food to regain your strength? Okay. No, Auntie. I don't want to eat. I'm not hungry. You don't want to eat? Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Um, let me get you changed. Let's go in. Okay. Babe. Yeah, honey. Food is ready. Okay, I'm coming. Let me just quickly finish up. God, what is this now? You came to the kitchen to assist me and I said no. Here you are sweeping the room. Why? It's no big deal now, eh? I'm just sweeping, only sweeping. You know, we've not swept since morning. But I told you not to do this. Did I not? Let me handle it. Please. Please. Pregnancy shouldn't turn me into a lazy person. Uh uh now. Nobody says you're lazy. I just, sweetheart, you know why we are doing this. Please. <sighs> Let's go and eat. This is getting out of hand. Let's go and eat first. What can we talk about? This heli girl missing her room. Because I always have that feeling that she misses her mom just the way my son would have missed me. Hmm? Alexa, you have a son? It's a long story. Cut it short. I met this young guy where I used to work. He was nice and calm, lovely, wanting to lead to another. I got pregnant for him, thinking he's going to get married to me. But his parents was against our marriage. And things become tough and hard for us. I have no option than to let go of this guy after giving birth to his baby. I left the baby for him and ran away. And he let you run away? He tried to make me stay. He really loved me, but his people were after my life. So I had to go. I had to run away from my, from my dear life. Anyways, that's, that is by the way. Can we talk about how I can become richest woman, please? Ah. <sighs> Alexa, at this point, I think you need an urgent medical attention. Yes, because how can you abandon your child and a man that loves you. And you're here talking about getting married to another woman's husband. 
Are you sure you're okay? Sometimes I regret telling you things. Can't you just understand me? Must you always judge me? There's nothing Please. there to understand. Please, come and be going. I'm already on my way. I need to check it, girl. I don't understand you anymore. Bye bye. <laughs> Thank you. How's my baby girl doing? Oh, she's fine. She's doing her assignments inside. Oh, then I'm not going to announce myself so she doesn't get distracted. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to get done with the assignment. Um, can you take this to the kitchen for me? Sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And uh, get me a chilled bottle of water, okay? Okay, sir. All right. Um, excuse me, sir. Hallie mm. uh, refused to eat when she got back from school. She said she doesn't feel hungry. What? Are you sure she's okay? I wouldn't know. I guess you should find out yourself. I asked her severally and she insisted that she was okay. That she wouldn't eat. All right, all right. I think I need to talk to her myself. There must be a reason why she doesn't want to eat. Okay, sir. I don't know much, but I know I love you. <laughs> I'm actually doing this for the sake of my unborn child. Hmm? So that when he comes out, yes, when he comes out, I will name him after myself. He? Yes. How did you know the baby is going to be a boy? Um, let's just see. I just know. Yes. And I'm going to name him after myself, like I said. Napoleon Jr. <laughs> <laughs> Avec, stop dreaming, Joe. There is no medical proof that the baby is going to be a boy or a girl yet. Um, well, babe, um, don't you think it would be wise for you to go to the hospital to ascertain the health condition of the child? Mm, it's too early, but if you insist, I'll go. I insist. Mm. So can I go back to being our alcoholic husband, like you said? You can. Well done. And thank you very much. Don't worry. You're welcome. Thank you so much, Sully. Thank you so much for today. Uh, you really helped me a lot. At least I wasn't as stressed as I normally am when I get back from work. You're welcome, sir. But you really don't need to keep thanking me again and again. I really love being around your daughter. So, yes... I enjoy my new job. Job? <laughs> job, you call it. The work you refuse to take any money for, yet you call it a job. Well, um, the joy that Helly, your daughter, gives me is worth more than any pay. Plus, you've made me really comfortable in this little heaven of yours. <laughs> and... Um, I'm always so glad to be around you. Really? Are you serious? Like, are you really serious? Um, seriously. Okay, I, I really don't know how to say this, but I'm going to say it in my own little way. I wish I could always see such handsome, caring, gentle... Hold it, hold it. Um, you better stop right there, girl, because 
your words uh, started to strike some serious <laughs> twitching inside of me. And uh, I don't want to say I'll be in a different part of the house. So just stop it. Oh, I, I think my daughter needs me. Uh, Sami, just give me a moment, okay? I'll be right back. Let me tend to my baby girl. All right. All right. Okay. God, please. Just grant me this one wish. I mean, just look at this man. He's so handsome, caring, so loving. God, please just grant me this one wish to be with him forever. <sighs> Countenance exudes happiness and excitement. So, what's the story behind it? <sighs> well, the doctor said that the pregnancy is in good shape. Okay, mm -hmm. that's a good news. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm really happy. So, did he run an ultrasound? Uh uh, nah. He said that would be at least 11 weeks into the pregnancy. And I am still very far, like very, very far okay. from that. Yeah. I have no problems. We'll wait till then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'm hmm. really happy. I am. Not happier than I am. Life is a puzzle. No need to struggle It takes only a genius to solve this puzzle There are little things that matters Little things that makes big difference But we choose to look it over how long will it take for you to understand that every action counts? So pay attention to details. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Pay attention to details. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Oh, no, 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 no. The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Oh, no, 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 no. The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Nobody is entitled to the bright side of life. If you spark the fire, then it will burn for you. Nobody is entitled to the bright side. Hi. Hey, you. <laughs> How are you? Fine. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Oh, yeah. You from. Uh... I'm the other day with my friend. Yes. 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 How are you? I'm, I'm fine. Okay. Um, um I, I'm just coming from your house. My house? Uh, yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> what do I owe the special I, surprise visit to? Um, I, 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 my friend lives around, so I just went to say hi. I noticed you live around, and I did I to say hi, good evening. Okay, good that, that is so nice of you. <laughs> That's so nice of you. Yeah. Oh, well, I'm I'm home most of the time in the evening, so uh, 
I mean, you can stop by another time and say hi. Oh, really? Right? I will, I will. Yeah. I will. I'm, I'm happy to see you here now. <laughs> yeah, good to see you too. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. So, uh, nice to see you again, okay? Nice to see you too. All right. I, um, uh, I'll see you around. Okay. Life okay. Is a <laughs> right. bye -bye. okay. Yeah. Bye. No need to struggle. It takes only a genius to solve this puzzle. Daddy. Yes, oh, sweetheart. I don't like Auntie Somi again. What? What did she do to you? She was forcing me to eat even when I told her I was not hungry. I, she was forcing me. <sighs> sweetheart, I think. She was just trying to make sure that you are okay. And besides, why didn't you eat when she asked you to? You knew you were hungry. But Dad, you told me to not collect things from strangers. And she was forcing me. Darling, Auntie Somi is not a stranger anymore. She's like a part of this family now. She helps take care of you. So, from time to time, she's going to give you food. Please, eat. You can't stay hungry till I get back from work every day. Do you understand me? Okay, thank you. And? As a God-fearing child, you don't have to say you don't like people. Because every human being was made in the image of God. So, we have to like everybody. Okay? Thank you. Alright? No tip, Daddy. Good girl. Alright. Chop knuckles. What? Chop, you know. <laughs> what did I do? You are missing the knuckles. <laughs> Okay, there are little yeah, things okay. that matters, little things that makes big difference. But we choose to look it over. How long will it take for you to understand that every action counts? So pay attention to details. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Pay attention to details. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Oh, no, 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 no. The future holds great things. But you have to plan oh, for the best days. Oh no 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 The future holds great But you have to plan So what happened to the one? Oh sorry. I thought it's twelve. Nobody is in three fifty five times twelve. To the bright side of life. If you spark the fire, then it will burn for you. Nobody is entitled to the best things of life. Life runs in circles when it's on its table. Whatever you've turned out is what you pick at the table. Life runs in circles. Ha <laughs> 
come one day and you'll get to see her and spend time with her? I can't wait any longer. I want to see my mommy. You know what, darling? Let's just go to bed tonight and uh, tomorrow I will take you to see your mommy. What do you say about that? No, I want to see my mommy today. to go to the hospital for proper checkup. I'm fine. I'm okay. What do I need the checkup for? Is that going to bring back my baby? I know that what has happened has happened. Oh, we cannot just give up hope like that. We need to keep believing. Right now, I am hopeless. I wish there wouldn't be any tomorrow for me. I'm tired. I'm fed up with this thing people call life. I am tired. <sighs> I can't, I can't keep living this way. I can't, I can't bear the shame of not being able to carry a child in my womb. I can't. For the second time, two straight pregnancies, lost just like that. I'm tired. I feel your pain. I do. See, I promise you, a day shall come when you will carry your own child. I promise you someday you will be a mother. Let's, let's just keep believing. Alexa, I've saved my own. The ball is now in your court, so are you no longer a child? You're old enough to make your decision. Decision or no decision? Can you just answer my request? What's your request exactly? Accompany me to go see my son. Oh, babe, have you forgotten? I told you I have conference today. Don't oh, worry, I'll go alone, okay? But how do you intend to find him? Are you sure he still lives in this city? Ah, 
Don't worry, I will. Trust me, you've not thought about that, obviously. <laughs> I will. Sorry. Uh, yeah, uh, listen, I just want to let you know that I'm, I'm going to be home today. Uh, I won't go to work, so uh, I would love you to come around, keep me company, if that's okay. Yeah, yeah, so I'll be expecting you, okay? All right. Okay, see you soon. Bye. It's gonna be a lovely day. Life runs in circles when it's on its table. Whatever you've turned up, Babe. sorry I kept you waiting. Let's go to the hospital. What is it? Why are you still crying? You don't know how painful it is. You seriously do not know what it means, what it means for me to lose this baby that I had so much hope on. Babe, I understand. All right, we both had hope. We both did. And I chose to take care of the house chores because I really wanted this baby to live. Yes, we both tried our best for this child to stay. But the child obviously didn't want to stay. I stayed in my mother's womb. Why won't my own baby stay? Why? Sweetheart, I promise you, you will have your own baby someday. When? When? Which day? God, please, when? When? When are you ever going to wipe my tears? When? It's okay. Alright. Let's just go to the hospital so you'll be taken. <laughs> Alexa, what is it now? Get off my way! Oh, you think you're stubborn, right? You think you can do whatever you want, Richard, and get away with it. <laughs> Listen, I am not cut out for your madness. Leave my way now or you won't like what I'll do to you. Oh, is that supposed to be a threat or what? Now listen and listen very good. I have tolerated you enough. I have been calm all this while. Oh, you think I don't know what has been going on in that house? Mm, Madam, don't all, since you know all that's been going on. Tell me what has been going on. Tell me about it. What has been going on? Ah, uh, anyways. I am not here to banter words with you, but just a reminder that you're playing with fire. And I promise you, I will make sure you regret your actions. I will not regret anything, all right? Get that into your head. And for your information, Richie and I are already bonded together. And there's nothing anyone, not even a commoner like you, who pushes herself on a man can do about it. How dare you? Are you mad? Did you just slap me? <laughs> you know, I realize I have developed such strong feelings for you. <laughs> It's crazy, I don't even know when it started, but I know I have this strong attraction to you. And uh, <laughs> it's, it feels good though. It feels really, really good. 
I'm so glad this is finally coming from you. You know, all along I've been waiting to... This is from Miss Aina. He's calling me. I hope my daughter is okay. Excuse me. Here. Hello? Yes, I'm, I'm fine. You? Okay. Yes, I'm home. What? Okay, I'll, I'll be right there. I will be right there. Okay, all right. What's wrong? What happened? What would be the problem? so I can fix it for you. I have to catch some breath before that. Okay. One more thing. Please, try as much as you can to take your medications religiously. You know I'm barely around. I will. Please. Oh. Oh. I guess I have to eat now so I can take the afternoon tablets. Okay, that's nice. So what would you like to eat? Anything, anything you can fix. Okay. Let me go fix something very fast for you, okay? Alright, thanks baby. Thank you so much, madam. I really appreciate it. No problem. Um, I think she has fever. And um, when I called you, you said I should hold on. I wanted to take her to the school clinic. No, it's okay. I prefer my uh, family doctor taking a look at her. He will do the checkup, whatever she needs. Okay. He will take care of it. Just take care of her, okay? I will. I, will. I have to rush her. Let me take her to the hospital. Right. Don't right. act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Oh, no, 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 no. The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Oh, no, 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 no. Alexa, I gave it to them. My conference was top notch. Like, the whole English in my mouth came out today. <laughs> oh, my word. Alexa, are you okay? What is it? You can't believe my son is dead. Jeez! Oh my goodness. Oh, sweetheart, I'm so sorry. So sorry about your loss. How is it, Dad? <sighs> the young guy keeps telling me he wants me back in his life. Saying a lot of things that doesn't interest me. After all these years, he still loves you? Diana, the truth is, we did love each other. From the look of things, his feelings towards me are still genuine. Then in that case, I think you should consider him. Yeah. And then just change topic a bit. What kind of, what kind of talk is that? You just said you guys loved we each other so much. Change the topic. How was your conference? Forget about the conference. Your son is more important here. So sorry about your loss. We should be talking about lightening your mood. Not conference, my darling. Baby. 
babe. I'm home. It takes only a day to do so. What is it and why are you like this? Lead to things that makes big difference. But we choose to look it over. Welcome. That did not answer my question. Mom called not long ago. Yes, or my my mom. She called to know how I and the baby are doing. And the answer you give her is to sit down here and cry. Right? Do you even know how it hurts? How much it hurts walking into you like this? I'm sorry, okay? Just I couldn't bear the pain. Mom said she has already started making arrangements to go for Mupo. And what did you tell her? Obviously, you didn't tell her what happened. Listen, I think it's time I cut off every form of communication with our parents. Especially mine, because her pressure is really getting too much. As for yours, I'll explain things to her because I feel she's more understanding than mine. Will your mom understand? Will she? Because she's actually my fear. When the doctor confirmed that I was pregnant, I was really excited with the hope that I was going to give your mom a grandchild so she can allow us some peace. I know I... You know what? Can we just stop talking about this for once? Because we have important things to talk about this evening. So... Come here. Come here. Sit down. Ah, uh, no, I'm sorry. I'm actually in haste. Um, I've been really uncomfortable, so I decided to use my extra minutes for my chores to come see if you're back and check up on Harley. Um, first of all, let me apologize for how I behaved. I, I look, I, I was, uh, it was crazy. I panicked and uh, I shouldn't have left like that, but yeah. I, I'm sorry. No, 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 you, you don't have to be, it's okay. The good thing is she's back and she's okay, right? Yeah, it was fever, but yeah. you know me, I don't joke with my daughter, so I took her to the hospital to make sure she was okay. That's cool, so yeah. is she getting better? Yeah, she's she's even asleep. I would have asked her to come and say hi to you, but she, she's <laughs> sleepy. <laughs> no, that's fine. Um, all right, I have to be on my way now. Take care of my bestie for me. All yeah, right, and uh, you take care of yourself too. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Thank you. Wait, wait, wait. Don't tell me you still have the guts to go to Richard's house. Alexa, I still have the guts to go to Richard's house. What will you do about it? Hey, this girl, you're playing with fire. Mm. You are really, really playing with fire. Are you aware of that? Look at a nice spark calling herself fire. Just get off my way. Hey, come back here. Just thank your stars I'm in a good mood. If not, if not what? Huh. Alexa, get into that mood. Get into that mood and, and show me what you're capable of doing so I can show you what it is actually to play with fire. So me, you're just piling up emotional pains for yourself. Richard does not belong to a cheap, dirty girl like you. Mm. The earlier you realize that, the betterment for your useless life. <laughs> okay, Alexa, let me tell you this. If you're doing all this for my mind to get off Richard, you are just joking. Hell no, it's not working. Try me. Richard belongs to me and you should get that into your thick skull. Excuse me. She just pushed me. We shall see! Ah! 
Listen, oh, I am not in for your pesky attitude this evening, so just let me be, please. Tommy, Tommy, why are you saying that? What, what is, is it now? What is it? Why are you sad? What is wrong with you? Did anyone get you angry? He's not that stupid lady. One stupid lady, I don't even know the planet she 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 operated herself from. Can you imagine telling me that I should leave I should leave her man alone? That that she has been eyeing the man I, I, and then I, I'm acting as a barrier to her. This is my boss she's talking about to so my own ogre. Do I know where they brought up their own problem from? I don't know this lady. I don't know this woman. How will she announce it that it's because of me that he's snobbing her? How? I, I want to understand something. So all this stress, all this plenty talk now that you are saying. All this thing is just for you are fighting over a man. No, listen. No, you are fighting over a man. I See, never you are told you I fought. Okay, read my lips. Don't put words in my mouth. Hey, but all this talk now, don't you know that mouth battle is is in fact is heavier than even punch. Is heavier than punch. So you you are, you are fighting over a man. After I've, I've told you, I told you I love you. After everything I said, I tried. I even told you that I went to, I told you that I would go extra mile to even prove it to you. So, me, why, why are women like this? Why are you people like this? Listen. Instead of you to have small sense, I even fall in love with the man that is in love with you. You left me and you are fighting over a man. Listen. Listen to me. You see that extra man you want to go for me? Go on it for yourself, okay? Learn how to dress well. Learn how to speak well. Learn how to act well. Smell nice and stop pestering my life. Hey, wait. Rubbish. Hey, wait. Hey, wait. Learn how to smell well. Hey, wait. That's an insult, though. Hey, Sami. Sami. <coughs> Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, baby. <sighs> Are you sure? I'm fine, baby. <sighs> I want to appreciate you for your love and care all this while. For the way you take care of me, comparing me, and making sure I lack nothing. <coughs> um, I love you. And you are my wife. And that automatically gives you access to all those things you mentioned. I mean, if I don't take care of you, who will? I know it's your responsibility, but then I need to seriously appreciate you. You're the best husband any woman can ever wish to marry. Thank you. Thank you for being there for me in my time of pain and agony. Thank you. I love you so much. When it's on its table, whatever you tend out is what you pick at it. I love you too, darling. Life runs in safe. When it's on its table, whatever you've tend out, what you pick at it. Daddy. Daddy. What is it now? Knocked out of what do you want? What are you doing now? It's late. I want to sleep. I'm tired. That's the the injection they gave me is paining me. Do you want chocolate? No, I want yogurt. Oh. So it's about yogurt. Promise me if I give you this yogurt tonight, you won't cry again. Because if you cry, I will spank you. I promise. Relax. Lie down. Let me go and get the yogurt. Okay. <sighs> 
little things that matters Little things that makes me different When we choose to look it over How long will it take for you to understand that A reaction counts So yeah, look at this little angel of mine she keep me up the whole night, but then take her time, enjoy her morning sleep whilst I'm up doing all the chores in the house. Hey. Wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey. Good morning, darling. Hey, good morning, sir. Are you strong enough to go to school today? Yes, daddy. Good. Then you have to hasten up. Time is against us. Uh, go to the bathroom, take your shower, brush your teeth, and uh, let's go. But Daddy, is Auntie Sammy not coming to pick me up today? She's already on her way, darling. That's why you have to be fast, okay? Hurry up, let's go. Almost done? Okay. Lisa, uh, Sammy, uh, please help me take Haley to school. I'm very late. All right, I'm already done. No, Daddy, I want to come with you. Haley, <laughs> baby, you can't, you can't follow your dad. He's going to work. Uh, darling, Daddy's pretty late. Okay. I have to go, I have so many things to do at the office. So, um, Auntie Sammy will take you, okay? No, I want you to take me to school. But you're the one who wanted Auntie Sammy to come and take you to school. You don't want her to take you anymore? Why? Huh? Hayley, don't worry, okay? Let me take you to school. Let Daddy go to work. When we go out, I'll get you ice cream. No, I want to go with my Daddy. Um, Sami, please uh, just help me lock up, okay? I will see you later. Let me just say good Come on, let's go. Thank you, sir. All right, Sami, thank you. All right, bye. All right, bye bye. Nobody is in time to be of life if you spark the fire. So, Alexa, what do you intend to do? What do you mean, what did I intend to do? I'm talking about you and your ex. You said he wants you back, so... Moss, you always talk about my ex each time we say. Moss, you always bring my past. What is it? Calm down. You know, you said he still loves you. So, considering the fact that you guys had a thing and all that, I think it's better you consider him. Rather than fighting Sumi over Richard. Um, who told you I fought Sumi? <laughs> My dear, nothing done under the sun is hidden. And besides, Sumi has come to warn me severally to caution you to stay away from Richard. Although I didn't deem it necessary because I know you will come back to your senses. I have actually come back to my senses. In fact, I am in my right frame of mind. And I'm certainly not leaving Richard for anyone. Where am I going back to my ex? Alexander! Diana! Rest! Are you my friend? I give up. I will shift go on. Please come and give me the food. I'm hungry. Now. Thank you. Christ, what is wrong with you? I hear you. You want to implicate me this afternoon? Are you okay? What are you doing? Okay? If I tell you now, what will I tell people? Little witch. Walking around like a ghost. That is how you walk around implicating everybody. Now get out of the road. Get out! I said get out of the road! Get out! Get out! 
Please. You said send you this afternoon. Tell them you did see me. All right? You did see me. Who beats you? One auntie beats me on my way coming. Oh, so sorry, okay? Stop crying, okay? Um, can you remember your dad's contact? Yes. Are you serious? Okay, type it in. Okay. But you have to plan for the best day. Um, good day, sir. But you have to plan it Alexa. My daughter is with you? How? Yes, sir. Um, don't worry yourself. I will take good care of her. I just, yes, I just got to let you know that she's at my place in case you come home looking for her. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Please just take good care of her for me, okay? Uh, yeah, I will do just that. I will do just that. Okay, thank you so much, Alexa. I really appreciate it. Okay, sir. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Don't worry, I'll, what do you want to eat? Hmm? Don't worry, let's go. I'll buy you anything you want, okay? My little angel. You are so good. Why is your face still like this? I want to see my daddy. I want to see my daddy. Or your daddy will soon be here, okay? Just tell me what you want me to get for you and I will get it. I don't want anything. I want to see my daddy. Okay. Have you heard a story about a little bird that won a lottery and was tricked by the tortoise? Auntie, I love stories. Really? And I will tell you more. Just tell me what you're going to eat and I will get it for you. While eating, I can be telling you a lot of stories. <laughs> okay. I want to eat snacks. Snacks? Snacks and what? Just snacks. You don't want juice? Are you sure? I'll get this for you. I'll be back. Just a few minutes, my friend. Auntie, please hurry up. I can't wait to hear your story. Things that matters, little things that makes big difference. But we choose to look it over. How long will it take for you to understand that every action counts? So pay attention to details. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Pay attention to details. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Oh, no, 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 no. The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Oh, no, 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 no. The future holds great things, but you have to plan. You expect me to be happy. When 
you, you put my daughter's life in jeopardy. You expect me to be happy. You expect me to be happy when you couldn't keep a simple promise you made to me as a school, as, as a manager, to protect my daughter? What kind of school manager are you? Seriously, I don't understand what you mean. What did I do to your daughter? I came to you as a mother, as a mother, and I talked to you, and I said, please, never allow my daughter to leave the school by herself. Mm. I asked you. You said yes. Oh, I'm so sorry. It was not intentional. I had an urgent call from the house that my house was about to burn down. I had to rush home. Please. It's not intentional. It won't happen again. I'm so sorry. And I didn't get back to the school till after school hours. So I didn't know what happened. I'm so sorry about that. Please, Please make sure that doesn't happen again. Do you understand me, ma'am? Yes, sir. I'm so sorry. It won't happen again. Okay, that's why I wanted to see you. I didn't want to come to the school, so people don't know what's going on. Okay. All right. Thank you. You have a good day. You know, it's been long I saw you this happy. <laughs> I mean, this is your friend actually did a good job with you. You can say that again. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what? Maybe next time if we're going there, we could go there together. How did you know what I was about to say? She was really upset that I didn't come with you. So I promised her that I will talk to you to see if you would agree to come with me next time I'm visiting her. There is nothing there. Wholeheartedly, we'll go there together. <laughs> you know, I've asked you how your ride went, but seeing you home shows it went smoothly. <laughs> Babe, my ride was not that smooth, though. I almost killed a little girl today with my car. You what? I almost hit a little girl with my car today. Huh. What happened? Were you speeding or what? I wasn't oh I don't even know where she came out from. She was just crying and, and, and crossing the road very slowly, like a snail. Okay, wait. Is she okay? Yeah, she's okay. She's fine. But I did give her a dirty slap when I alighted. God. Why now? Why would you do something like that? I mean, how can someone who is expecting the fruit of the womb from God go about slapping little children? What does that make you? I'm sorry. It was just out of anger. I... I understand. Okay. I do. Listen. When next you see a little girl, use that opportunity to make up for this particular one. Good? What if I buy stuff and visit a nearby orphanage? What do you think? What is the meaning of this? I have been waiting here for you. Me? Why? What business do I have to do with a brat like you that made you stand waiting for me? Oh, you called me a brat, right? Well, listen and listen very carefully. Your desperation for Richard will lead you to the path of your doom. The same desperation will ruin your life, so better stay clear. <laughs> really? You see why I called you a brat? You're just a kid that doesn't know where she belongs. <laughs> Who 
made you think Mr. Richard who soup too low to make you his wife or a fiancé? You see everything you just said right now. We will be positive at the end. Let's see who suffers her depression to have Mr. Richard. Rubbish. Please get the silly stuff out of my side. Come back here. I'm not done with you. Where did you think you were going to? Huh? Where do you think you're going? Now listen, we both will know who the brat is when I'm done with you today. What did you just say? When I am done with you, we both will know who the brat is. How dare you? Yeah? You just slapped me. Ah! You slapped me. Are, you, are you crazy? Are you mad? You slapped me. I did. And I'll do it again. I'll do it. I'll do it again. Come on. Come on. I'll kill you today. You are stupid. Darling. Yes, Dad. You know, I owe you an apology. Apology? Yes, apology. I should have come to pick you up today. But I didn't. I got so occupied with uh, work. And uh, someone else had to bring you home. But Dad, you've always been there for me. You don't have to apologize. Thank you, darling. I know, but I'm your father. I'm your protector. I should always be there for you. And if I can't, I should make a proper arrangement for that. Okay, Dad. But Dad, I love Aunt Alexa. You only met her today. You love her already. What makes you say you love her? Mm, she always makes me happy. Really? Tell me more. She told me different stories about the brilliant trickster Tortoise. Mm. And later then, she sang beautiful songs to me mm. till I fell asleep. And you know I love stories and songs too. So that's it. Okay. All right. So uh, one of these days I will invite her again so she will come around and perhaps tell you some new stories or sing for you if you like. Would you like that? Yes, then. Okay. We'll see about that. The trouble. Is what you be cut it Life runs in circle. When it's on its table, whatever you turned out is what you be cut it So come in, the door is open. Hey. Hey. You look. You look so beautiful. Thanks. I know. I know you must have missed this so much. Yeah. So I decided to surprise you. That's right. Because I missed you. joking right i have this feelings all over my body that he has entered again <laughs> you're pregnant i believe so oh, i have been feeling dizzy and everything nauseates i feel like throwing up all the time okay i'm so happy I'm so, 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 so happy, baby. 
I think you need to see the doctor. I will. Please, you need to be very careful this time and more prayerful. Okay? Yeah. This child must stay. In fact, he has to stay. Yeah. God, I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. I didn't know you were this beautiful, attractive, and sweet. How would you know when you never pay attention to my advances? I'm glad you did today. Yeah. I'm glad I did too. And we don't have more of this going forward. Thank you for sharing your full self, your body, with me. I love you. I love you too. God, I have never asked you for something and you didn't grant it. Please do this one for me, as you have always done. I love Richie so much and I can't wait to be his woman. I love his daughter too and I want to be there for her, giving her the motherly care and attention she needs. Remembering how happy she was listening to my stories and how excited she was as I sang for her. The peace and calmness of her heart as she slept on my body is just breathtaking. I would love to give her those comfortable moments forever as well as help her dad out to ease his stress. God, please just do this for me. And I will be so happy on earth. I can't continue to live like this. I really need a woman in my life. I have waited enough for Haley's mom to come back to us, but it's obvious she won't. She's not going to come back. I can't wait any longer. Somi has awakened a vacuum created by the absence of Haley's mom in my life. Somi has awakened the feeling to a woman by my side. Not just for sex, but for many reasons. Getting myself another wife would help me a lot. And Sami is ready. She's ready to settle down if I can open up to her. I need to make that move. I need to. Yes, Daddy. You know, you 
you've always asked that she want to see your mom. You always say that you miss her. When is she going to come back to us? Yes, Daddy. I can't wait any longer. But you said she'll come, but I've never seen her. Sweetheart, the truth is, I'm not sure your mom will ever come back to us. So, I have decided to get married. I want to marry Auntie Sumi so that she can take care of you always. No. I like Auntie Alexa. Oh, nobody. But you, you, you said you love Auntie Sumi and Auntie Alexa. You've only known her for a few hours. How are you sure she's the right woman for your dad? I like Auntie Alexa. Honey, Sumi has always been nice. I think. All right, it's fine. Right. Don't be sad. All right. Don't be sad. All right, let's go to bed. Let's go to bed. Don't get sick, okay? Okay, Daddy. You're the air that I breathe. You're the one hey, that I love. Where are you? <laughs> Someone is really excited. <laughs> I'm actually overjoyed right now. Wait. You've been confirmed pregnant. Yes, baby. <laughs> oh, God. Father Lord, I thank you. I thank you, I bless your name, I lift your name on high. I say be thou exalted, O oh Lord, in my life in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Father, thank you for another wonderful opportunity to be a father. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Sweetheart, you're welcome. Thank you so much, baby. I I now believe everything you have ever told me. I never knew I would be so happy again. Sweetheart. As long as there is life, there is hope. Okay? So why don't you just go in, freshen up. Let me round up what I was doing before you came in so I can make you a very delicious meal. Okay, babe. Thank you so much. Thank you. It's okay. <laughs> oh, God. Thank you. Thank you, God. for your auntie. She's not my auntie. I want Auntie Alexa. Okay. I understand, but go help me open the door for her. No. I don't want to see her. What? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Haley, you don't want to greet me. How are you? Haley, are you not going to say hi to Auntie Sammy? Haley? 
What was that about? What's going on? I'll be right back. Don't tell me you're full already. Mm. Seriously, I can't squint in anything more. I'm okay. Oh, babe, please just eat a little for our baby. Mm. <laughs> I can't. You know what? Why don't you do the eating? Our baby will enjoy from your stomach <laughs> later. <laughs> I see. Mm. You know where I give up. <laughs> <laughs> um, babe. Mm? I've been thinking. About what? I've been thinking about what to do to make sure this baby stays. I don't mind doing anything. Anything at all to ensure this baby stays. Okay. So what's that? I'm thinking about inviting the pastor to come here pray from time to time. Hmm. What do you think? It's a good idea. I like it. Okay. Then in that case, I'll reach out to him. Alright? Okay. So, like you said earlier, let me continue eating so that the baby will see what to eat. I beg eat. Eat Yet another unimaginable problem has presented itself. My major aim of getting married is to provide a comforting hand for my daughter. Her happiness is my priority in this. And she blatantly rejected a lady I already shared some intimacy with. Sami is a very nice person. She's calm and she's humble to the core. And she already knows what I need in a woman. And to crown it all, she is such a pro in the other room. Why should Haley be an obstacle to this? Why should she choose Alexa, an ordinary neighbor? I know absolutely nothing about Alexa. Richie. Richie. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, what? What's with you? You're absent-minded. What's with you lately? You're always moody, absent-minded. What's the problem? What's going on? Sami, I don't think you will understand. My daughter is setting me off for something else. She worries me a lot. Um, you can confide in me. What does she do? What does she want? Can you help me solve this puzzle? A puzzle? What puzzle? Say I wake up one morning and I decide to take my daughter to the market to buy something for both of us. But my major objective is to buy something that my daughter will love because I really want to please my daughter. But also I want to buy something that I can still be able to use. And 
Upon getting to the market, my daughter decides she wants option B. But I think that option A is the best. In that case, what do I do? Okay. Um, like you said, that your major objective is to please your daughter, right? Yeah. So you should get option B. You should buy her option B since that's what she wants. Is talking. <laughs> when was the last time you came to my house? I've been good, I was just joking. Better. It's <sighs> calling me. Mm. This movie is quite interesting. Just a minute, please. Okay. Hello? Yes, this is Alexa. Good day, sir. <clears throat> yes, I'm fine. I'm okay. Yeah. <clears throat> no, no, no. I'm okay. I'm okay. Yeah. No, 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 no. no. I'm free. I'm, I'm free. Today, oh, don't worry. I won't tell you that. I'll, 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 be, I'll be there in a minute. Yes. Okay. Okay. You will see me there in a minute. Wait. Wait. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I'm not guess, good at guess, it. Guess, guess, please. What? <laughs> Tell me, what is it? Oh, my dream, I just got me. <sighs> oh my God, am I dreaming? Am I dreaming? No, oh, please wake me up. Wake me up, wake me up, wake me up. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Calm down. Okay. Let me talk. Uh, when did you guys exchange contact? I, he just called me that we needed to chat. I said, okay. I told him I'll be, I'll be there in a minute. Okay, I'll on. Oh, you know what? I need to go in and freshen up. I need to leave Stop now. it already. What's up with you? Why are you so excited like a high school girl who just fell in love? Abba. Hey, I don't understand you. Anyways, you can enjoy this house. As for me, I'm going to freshen up. Wait. You want to leave me here all because of a man? Come on, girl, I just got here. Point of correction. My man, not just a man. I mean, shift! <laughs> my friend has gone crazy. Ah! Let me see you come and leave now. Shabina, here you go, pass. Babe, what are you doing? What do you think you're doing? I'm looking for my ring. Your ring? Hey. Why do you find it so difficult to take simple instructions? How many times have I warned you not to lift anything heavy in this house? And here you are trying to lift something three times heavier than you are. What is it? I'm sorry. It's just that my ring fell off, and I think it's under this cushion. No, Let me look for it. Take. Thanks, baby. Let this thing not repeat itself again. I won't. I said sorry. I've heard you now. What's going on? You've not given me an answer. What is going on? I told you nothing. Or is this something you... Is there something of sense you want to talk to me about? You can't tell me it's nothing. Look at you. 
You've suddenly changed. You've suddenly changed. What's the problem? It, is it because we got Kano and now you no longer value me? Tell me we have to talk. Fine, I'm, I'm here and I'm listening. Tell me whatever it is so we'll get over with it and start off with the good life we've already begun. We can't talk now. I have this meeting, I have to go inside and freshen up for. I'm already late, I, I, I can't talk now. Fine, so when do we see again? I'll call you, I, when I'm free I'll call you and we'll set up a time. Okay, I have to be on my way now. Why, Sammy? But you have to plan for the best days. Nobody is entitled to the bright side of life. If you spark the fire, then it will burn for you. Nobody is entitled. Okay. I'm alright. Welcome. Of Thank life. you very much. Please, can we? Yeah, sure. I found sense when it's on the stage. You've turned out is what you pick at the table. Life runs in Thank you very much. Uh, and thank you for the entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's just a little way of welcoming you. <laughs> Pastor, you're welcome once again. Thank you very much. The major reason we invited you over is because of the predicaments my wife has been going through. She has taken in severally, and at the end of the day, it ends in miscarriage so this time around she has taken in again and we decided to seek for spiritual backup that's why we invited you over the devil is at work 
But today, the presence of God has come in. Amen. And it will take over. Amen. You know, the Bible says in John chapter 10 from verse 10, that the thief cometh not only but to steal, to kill and to destroy. But I have come that you might have life and have it to the fullest. Amen. Amen. Yes. The light of God has come into this family. Amen. And it will pursue every wicked spirit. Amen. Every agent of the darkness Amen. that locks around and causes those miscarriages. And all their plans will come to end today. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Shall we rise on our feet? In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Father Lord, we thank you. Those great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Nobody is entitled to the bright side of life. If you spark the fire, then it will burn for you. Nobody is entitled to the best things of life. Life runs in circles when it's on its table. Whatever you've turned out is what you pick at the table. Life runs in circles. When it's on its table, whatever you've turned out is what you pick at the table. So pay attention to details. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Pay attention. Pay attention to details. Oh, yeah. Don't act out of your feelings. Get your facts before the action. Pay attention. Pay attention to the to get this right are you by any chance saying that we hold no future together Sonny I'm so sorry Sonny it's not my making you know how much love I've, I've, I've started to feel for you how much feelings I've developed for you but as it stands, my hands are tied. Then I'm tired, Richie. You, just after sleeping with me, you're now creating excuses, right? No, I'm, I'm not creating excuses, Sami. To be honest, I wanted to marry you. I wanted us to be together f forever. But... I, what? But what? Richie, you, you've... You've always been this very nice man, and after sleeping with me, you changed it within a twinkle of an eye. No. Look, you have every right to be mad at me. You have every 
you have every right to to be angry. But please, don't think I'm selfish. I'm not doing this for me. I'm I'm doing this for my daughter, Sumi. It's for my daughter. I I understand you. I truly do. The reason I came into your life was to make things easy for you. I did not collect salary from you because I love you. In that light, Richie, I want you to know that I hold nothing against you. I'll just, I'll just move on with my life. I'll come once in a while to see you, that if you permit me to. Thank you. I, um, I appreciate your understanding. And I assure you, you're my friend. Anytime you need me, I'll be there for you. I, um, I want you to know that I'll always be there for you. Some I pray you find a man, a man who's going to love you, who's going to cherish you, who's going to adore you, a man who's Who's going to give you everything I've dreamt of giving you? Thank you, Sami. Amen. There are little things that matters, little things that make big difference, but we choose to look it over. Oh, babe. How long will it I don't know what is going on. Honestly, I mean, it feels like a whole lot of things are after us. From one miscarriage to the other. We need to start looking for a solution. Because something in me tells me someone is after us. <sighs> I think I'm the problem here. What makes you believe you're the problem? Uh, uh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry that I haven't told you this part of me before. Please forgive me. I don't understand what part of you. I, um, I, I actually had a daughter with another man. I, I left him because of his inability to meet up with my financial demands. <laughs> You're joking, right? No. I'm serious. <sighs> okay, yeah. The, the, the most painful part of this whole thing is that the baby was actually so small when I left. I, I, okay, I... That fateful day, I had a serious quarrel with my husband and I threw the baby at him out of anger. He couldn't catch the baby and the baby fell on the floor. I, 
I don't know. I, I, I don't know if the baby survived or not. I, it was, it was so terrifying. I got so scared and I ran away. I ran. I, uh, so what? Each, 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 each time I take in, the flash of that event comes and, and after that I, I lose the pregnancy. Petrolina. Wait. So, all this while oh, going through all this, from one miscarriage to another, you kept this to yourself? I... I Good! What kind of a human being are you? Don't touch me! You lied to me that you were raped and that was how you lost your virginity and ever since then that no one has ever touched you. God, you were even married before now and you're just telling me... I... Don't touch me! Don't! <laughs> Lay a finger on me again and I will send you straight to the morgue. I'm so sorry, okay? I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, just... <laughs> Jesus Christ. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? <gasps> Babe, I'm sorry. I'm... Oh, no, no, no. Baby. <laughs> <laughs> So me. What is it? I don't know. I'm finished. I'm finished. I'm finished, cousin. I'm so finished. What happened to you? I've been fooled. I've been fooled. I just want the end to open so it can swallow me. I just want to die. I want to leave this wicked world. I want to die. Uh, 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 nothing like that. Nothing like that. See, whatever it is you are going through, eh? Don't worry. You can come over it. No? Don't worry. Sorry. Oh, let me take you to your house. No, no, no. I don't understand. I just... Nothing is happening to you. You won't understand. Eh, don't worry. Sorry. Sorry. Come on, Jamie, sing hallelujah. Hey! Do your body sing hallelujah? Come on, Jamie, sing hallelujah. Hey! Do your body sing hallelujah? Enough of dancing. Just me. What's up? What happened? Mm. I see jealousy. Ah. <laughs> From the look of things, things are falling according to plans, Abby. I'm the last person that will ever give up on anything my heart craves for. Anything my heart wants, I will go and I must get it. Alexa, this few lines sound cementing, like everything is settled. I had to force myself out. If not, Richie and his daughter won't let me go. Wow. Girl, I'm so happy for you. Mm. My friend is all loved up. God win, Abby. Have you ever heard audition God win? You and your American bubble go soon come back, tied in knots to carry you for this country and shouting God win. It's okay. Respect yourself <laughs> over your word. You can never, you can never, why can't you just be you? Oh, it's God okay win. now. Abba. Come on, Jamie, sing it. Hey, 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 no need to struggle It takes only a genius to solve this puzzle Daddy, mm -hmm. 
Is it Auntie Alexa you're chatting with? No, darling. I'm browsing through a website. I'm not chatting. But why is Auntie Alexa coming again? Why? Was she not here today? I want her to come again. Okay. I will invite her again. But Daddy, I want her to come now. She can come now. Why? Because it's late. <laughs> she can't. But why not today? <laughs> Honey, it's late. Auntie Alexa can't come here now. Or, um, wait, let me call her. I'll give you the phone so you can talk to her, tell her you want to see her now, and she will tell you why she can't come here. Because it's late to you. It's not late to me. Okay, let's see. Babe. Baby. What is it? Baby, you're not supposed to be sleeping in the bedroom. Hey, what's what? your business with where I decide to sleep? This is my house. So I sleep wherever I choose to sleep. Babe. Don't you dare call me that name again. Because you've been fooling me all this while with that particular name. I've been married to someone else's wife all this while without knowing it. You know what? Very soon you will get what you deserve because you're going to sign divorce papers very soon. Babe. No, don't, don't, don't! Touch me and I promise you I'll break every single bone in your body. Now get out. Out! The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Nobody is. Hey, sit down. Thank you. Um. <clears throat> um. I'm sorry I came with my friend without informing you. Please forgive me. It's okay. I mean, you don't have to apologize about that. <laughs> But I'm can't see you here. Oh, my little Hi, angel. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. Good day, Auntie. Good day. How are you? I'm very fine. Obviously, you're very fine. Oh. Daddy's girl. You can see Daddy again. <laughs> now, Auntie, come here. Come. Sit down. Um, um, Diana. Meet Richie. Richie, meet Diana, my special advisor. Oh, come on, don't start. <laughs> nice to meet you, Richie. Nice to meet you, Diana. <laughs> okay, so um, what can I get for you guys to drink? Anything soft. Soft? Yeah. You too? <laughs> sure. Okay. Um, come see. Your okay. auntie is here, so you're not going to trouble me, right? Mm -mm. Hmm? Sure. Sure. You'll be a good girl. Yes, Daddy. Okay, come on, let's go. Let's get them something to drink. Okay. You go upstairs to watch TV, okay? Um, it's... I brought this for you. <laughs> Thank you so much, Auntie. You're welcome, my darling. Wow. This is quite expensive. You didn't have to do that. No, I have to. She's my baby. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Thank you. I You're appreciate it. Thank you. Come on, darling, let's go. I will be right back, okay? Okay. Oh, yeah. 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 And you've been throwing me to the mud. I know. But it was only because of the feelings I couldn't control. I was being fooled. 
please, now I realize my mistakes. I'm really sorry. Forgive me. You're sorry. You know, one can easily say sorry. Effortlessly. But healing the scars that prompted the apology takes years. I know. And frankly, I confess that I don't blame you if you do not want to have anything to do with me. I don't deserve to be in your life anymore. I just called you out here to apologize and to please ask for your forgiveness. And truly, I won't hold anything against you if you decide not to have anything to do with me. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. So, you know I forgive you already. Yes. And whatever you have between you and Richard is now in our past. And it's going to remain there forever. Because I love you. I love you too, cousin. And thank you so much for forgiving me. Thank you. Come here. I'm so sorry. Okay? Please forgive me. I beg you. Your tears don't move me anymore. The only thing on my mind now is how to end this charade called marriage. Why? I beg you, please don't do this to me. I beg you in the name of God, please. I know I deserve even worse than this, but if you truly love me, do not let my past foolishness ruin my life, please. Please. <sighs> What did I not do for you? I loved you. I provided for you. I cared for you. What, what did you do? You dragged me in the mud. That I cannot forget. I'm sorry. I am truly, truly sorry. Please. Okay, if, if you can't forgive me, help me end this miserable life. I, I'm tired of being haunted by my past. Just, just strangle me to death. Just kill me, let me die, and, 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 and let go of this whole pain, please. Please. God forbid. If you're looking for who to kill you, it's definitely not me. But the only advice I will give you is this. Go and look for your rightfully and lawfully wedded husband. I can't even stand his face. I can't. Yeah, he really did everything for me. He did everything possible to ensure that I was happy. He would stay hungry to ensure that I ate. <laughs> But my greed and lack of contentment made me do what I did to him. I know I, I should go and find him and ask him for forgiveness, but I can never ask him to take me back as a wife. I can't. And that's not all. You still go and look for your daughter's grave, kneel and beg her for forgiveness. That is if you still remember where he stays. I still remember where we lived before, but I don't know if he still stays there. I doubt. Anyways, that would be a good place to start. Thank you so much, baby. Thank you. <sighs> uh, I'm so heavy right now. I want to be heavy. 
when you were busy devouring the food like your life depends on it. My sister, I must confess that food was so tasty. Yeah. Ah. Which is a good cook. Mm. Oh, you can say that again. <laughs> Yo, I'm impressed. You know, I admire your courage in getting the man of your dream. Like, you wanted him and you went for him. And you got him. Haba. <laughs> Honestly, how do you do that? Teach me what. What cool. do you mean, how did I do that? I don't understand. What are you trying to say? Sorry, I, I must mention his name, Emzo. He seems to be caring, loving, calm. And you said you saw those qualities and turned your green lights. And he fell for you. Now, Richie, almost same thing. <laughs> and he's falling for you already. Like falling head over heels for you. Girl, how do you do that? All thanks to God. And as for Richie, he's not just that calm. He's gentle. Lovely. Oh my God. He's everything a woman needs. Aww. And above all, he's the baddest striker ever. What? <laughs> you guys already did it. You can see that again. I look so tired of you. <laughs> I'm tired of I this girl. Of the signs are already showing in my body. <laughs> what signs? Signs of pregnancy. Did they know? Tell me. Since it was pregnancy. confirmed medically that I'm pregnant. But I don't know. I'm I don't know. I'm looking for an opportunity just to break this news for him. I don't I don't know how to do it. I don't know. I just can't break it. I don't believe that part. No, 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 no. What? Mm -mm. Say something that it's a lie. You're lying. Me lying. You're not pregnant. I'm lying. Ah, well, how? Oh, just give me a second. I'm just gonna clear him down. <sighs> Good afternoon. Uh, what is that? Um, please, uh, there's something I want to ask you. Um, I'm looking for a certain Mr. Richard. Please, does he still stay here? Mr. Richard, Mr. Richard. I don't know anybody by the name Richard. Um, he used to live here, let's say, seven years ago. Any idea where he moved to? Oh, seven years ago. I'm sorry, I've not lived here up to five years. That's the problem now. But I think I I can remember I met um, someone here when I came in newly. And uh, I believe the person might know about the name Richard, yeah. Okay. Um, can you please take us to the person? <sighs> okay. It's all right. All right. So, should I? Yes, please come. Thank you. Thank you. Can come. No, just, you know, you gotta help me strategize. You want me to call her, right? Yeah, then what do we tell her? She was here today. Huh? To come again. Yeah, uh, just come again, okay. Let me try. 
Hello. Hello, Della. Hello, baby. What? Are you okay? You don't sound so good. No, not too much. I just saw my friend off. Oh, okay. Uh, it's about um, Haley. She um, she says she wants you to come back. She wants to see you. She has a surprise for you in appreciation for what you gave her today. Really? Come. Please, can you come again? Right now? Yes, Auntie. Okay, darling. Uh, you've heard her. Mm, yes. Um, you, you know I need to rest, but don't worry. You'll see me there in a short time, okay? Bye. Bye. Okay, sweetheart. Thank you. Or right, bye. Are you happy now? Get away. <sighs> Why do I have this feeling? Is <sighs> is Richie? Lena, so now you're looking for Richard Abby? Hmm? After what you did to Richard, you, Lena, you have come to look for Richard Abby? Eh? After calling that young man useless, after telling that man how, how useless his life was, now you have come to look for him. Ah! You can imagine life. Look at life now. Now you want me to come and help you look for, for Richard. My sister, please. Who is your sister? Oh. Let's just forget about these memories, okay? If you know where he stays, let's go there, all right? <laughs> no, now, Lina. I need to know because I was there when it happened. I saw everything with my two eyes. Yes. Eh? How you, how you, you nearly bring that, bring that, 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 that young man useless. Now you, you, you've come to look for him. How wicked can you be? Madam, please. I understand how you feel, all right? But we need to see him. We came from a very far place and we need to go back before dark. I beg you, please take us to him. Please. Please. Hey, please. Mm -hmm. Hold it there. <laughs> uh, my brother, <laughs> I will take you there. But if it's because of this evil woman, hey, I will not do anything. Eh? This woman nearly rendered that, that man useless. I understand. Please. As for you, you better be careful, be at a lot. Because the Richard that I know might break your head. Who knows if he will even allow you in. Thank you. Mm. Thank you. I beg, where should I enter? Mm. Here or there? Nobody is to the bright side it's not because of this man, I will not go. It's because of him. Then it will burn for you. Nobody is entitled to the best things of life. <laughs> Jeez, he's looking nice. Yeah, you're looking good. <laughs> Thank See, you. Um, so me, you don't know how happy I am to see us back together. <laughs> and I'm so happy that we're back together. You know, there's this fulfillment you've brought into my life. Thank you. <laughs> fulfillment that you left hanging. Since. Since you left this fulfillment hanging. Mm -hmm. Now you are enjoying it. Good man. <laughs> um, so, yeah? Uh, there's this thing I want to suggest to you. Okay, what would that be? Uh, why don't I take you to my mom? Really? Mm, I want to take you to my parents. Oh my God, I'm, I'm so delighted to hear this. Yes, I will take you to them. I will take you to my parents. I will tell them 
that this is the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. Oh my God. I'm, I'm, I'm so happy to hear this. And I'm sure your mom will like me because, you know, she, she has no choice. No choice. Once I present you to her, she must accept. <laughs> she will have no other choice than to accept. If not, that will take another 10 years before I get another woman. Babe, don't <laughs> say that. But seriously, your mom will be so glad because she has always liked us together during our college days. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. She has to. She has to <laughs> like us like that. <laughs> Thank you. I love you so much. I love you too. Hey, one more thing, man. Eh? Okay. One more thing. You see this, your mouth. I don't like the way you use it sometimes. Like that time you were telling me, eh, you have to change your clothes, you have to buy perfume, the way you smell, the way you smell. Is it nice? You want to use my mouth and kiss somebody? No, actually then I was... I, 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 didn't, I didn't mean it that way, I was only... Don't no, talk again before you say more. Before you know it now, you say something higher. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean it. Mm. I said, I'm so happy. Hey! Daddy, are you ready? Um, yes. Wait, wait, wait. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Alexa, darling, I um, I'm, I'm not I'm not really good at telling people how I feel about them, uh, but I want you to know that I love you, and I want this bond and our our love, our attraction, the, 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 the beautiful chemistry and everything we enjoy to last till nature calls us. Uh, Alexa, I want you in my life forever. And I'm asking you this moment, will you be my wife? <laughs> Auntie, please accept my dad. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, what kind of setup is this? <laughs> yes. 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 I I marry you. Yes. It's yes. a beautiful yes. setup, yes. right? Yes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you. So you to play me. Mm -hmm. You told me Halle has a surprise for me. Yeah, but wasn't that good enough a surprise for you? This is the best surprise I, I have so ever too. had in my life. Oh, in your life. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. I'm the man. <laughs> I have a surprise for you. You do? Mm hmm Okay. Guess. Oh, you know I can't guess. <laughs> you know I can't guess. Hi. I can't just tell me it was a surprise. Okay. Can let me tell you? Okay. I'm pregnant. What? Yes. What? <laughs> Are you serious? Yes. the house. Hmm? <laughs> At least I've tried. Hmm? Um, madam, hmm. are you not going inside with us? No, <laughs> I am not though, because I know what is about to happen in that house. Yes, so I'm not going in. <laughs> um, hey, 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 hold your money. I don't need your money. I don't need it. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Thank you.
Come in, the door is open. Are you serious? Am I dreaming of something? Lena, what are you doing in my house? Um, um, sir. What are you doing in my house? Please, we are not here to fight. We are here for peace. Daddy, this is the person that... She's the person that beats me on my way coming back from school. Oh, really? <laughs> After everything, she's so pizza. <laughs> Lena, what do you want? What do you want? I'm so sorry, okay? Please forgive me. I have not had peace of mind ever since I left you. I'm not even asking you to, to take me back because Obviously, you, you have a wife who has given you a beautiful child. All I want is your forgiveness. Please, the spirit of our dead daughter has been haunting me and Point of correction. Our daughter is not dead. Our daughter is right here, right in your presence. This is our daughter, the one you abandoned, the one you left to die. This is a child that was injured, but you left her instead of giving her that motherly nurturing that she needed from you. This is the child. She's not dead. She's alive. This is a child that you, you nearly knocked down. And you got down from your car and you beat her. This is the child. She's your daughter. You left me because I had nothing. You left me and even left your own child to die. Now guess what? This poor man you left is now doing so well and this daughter you left to die she's alive she's beautiful and she's strong <laughs> sir the truth is i cannot even begin to imagine what you've been through before now i am truly sorry i beg you in the name of god please Forgive her. Please. Please forgive her. For the sake of your daughter and the little memory you two must have had, please forgive her. No one is above mistake. Please. The truth is, I forgive her a long time ago. I have nothing in my heart against her. Given her. I forgave you a long time ago. But the person you need to ask for forgiveness is this one. This child. This child you left. This child that cried so many nights because she needed her mother, which you were nowhere to be found. You left. This is the child you should ask for forgiveness, not me. And if she forgives you, then who am I? To God be the glory. Oh, my sweet baby. 
my baby, my baby, my baby. Please forgive me for everything, both the past and the present. I'm your mother. And I have offended you so much. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Forgive me so so that I I can carry a child in my womb. Let your anger become my baby. I'm so Stop crying. We have been looking for you, and my daddy has been promising me you will come back. I've forgiven you. <laughs> Thank you, my baby. Thank you for forgiving me. Thank you. I love you, thank you. Thank you so much. I've forgiven you, but I won't leave my daddy. You don't have to. Okay. You don't have to. You can stay here with your daddy and and your auntie, okay? The most important thing is that you have forgiven money. Thank you. I love you. I love you too. Thank you. Life is a puzzle. No need to struggle. It takes only a genius to solve this puzzle. There are little things that matters, little things that makes big difference. But we choose to look it over. How long will it take for you to understand that? Every action counts So pay attention to details Don't act out of your feelings Get your facts before the action Pay attention to details Don't act out of your feelings Get your facts before the action Oh no 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 The future holds great things, but you have to plan for the best days. Oh no 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 no! The future holds great things, but you have to plan.